Yes. Oh, 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 oh. Hey, she won. And that's not the Don't play with it, don't play with it, don't play with it. Don't play with it. What's up, my readers? It's your girl, Nikki, and I'm back with another video, you guys. And I just did, like, a full-blown vlog. I really need to shower and get myself together. But I stopped at the grocery store because, y'all, today I started my first day at the gym. And I'm super-duper excited about it. So, y'all already know, like, it's like, I feel like with me, I don't know if this is anybody else, but, like, with the first day I get into the gym, I just... I don't know, because I, I never really did this before. This is kind of like my first time doing, well, not my first time. This is like my second time, like, getting in the gym, wanted to change my diet and stuff like that. So, um, after I went to the gym, I ended up going straight to progress before I came home. And I got some healthy food. I want to meal prep me, like, a meal for a week or whatever, just so I can stay kind of like on a good path because a lot of people was telling me when I was saying I was going to start my workout journey and even my trainer was telling me that it's, it works both ways. You know, working out could be the easy part, but you have to maintain, like, you know what I mean? Like, the, you have to eat well, too. And y'all know I love food. Y'all know I love cheeseburgers and pizzas and all the good fatty foods, but I love sugars. I love freaking zebra cakes. I just love it all, but... It's really time that I start taking my weight serious, my health serious. I really want to start maintaining my body. I love my body. I think I look really nice. But I do want, like, a smoother back. And I want to, like, get rid of some of the cellulite behind my, my legs. I just want to tone. I want to tone my body. And that's my reasoning for working out. It's not so much to lose weight, which I do kind of want to lose some weight. But it's more so just to look toned and look good when I look at myself. I, I look good. But I want to look better and I just want to like, I don't want all my money to go down the drain. I want to be one of those people who, oh, I work out, oh, I go get surgery and then after that I get right back big. Because I do think that when you get surgery, when you get liposuction, when you get fat added in certain places, that it does make you spread a lot and it does make you gain weight if you don't treat it the right way. And a lot of people be like, oh, I feel like after getting surgery, my weight has fluctuated so much. It has gotten, like, I, I before I got surgery, I was 190 pounds, 193 pounds. Currently, I am 207 pounds after post-surgery. And I think my doctors did what they were supposed to do. I just didn't do what I was supposed to do. So, anyways, I know I'm chatting a lot. I'm gonna do like a little grocery haul of what I got to like meal prep and what I got to um, get myself on the right path. My trainer told me to eat fruit, uh, lots and lots of fruit. Um, he doesn't eat meat, but I cannot give up chicken. I cannot give up meat. Maybe I'll give up like red meats or something. I'm not even sure. I can't make any promises. But what I can say is that I'm going to try to put effort into being a little bit more healthier with my diet and going on like a water and i don't want to like i don't want to say i'm on a diet because i feel like a lot of times when we say oh we're on a diet we're on a diet it puts so much pressure on us i don't want to necessarily make it like I want to make it a lifestyle. I don't want to make it a diet. You know what I mean? Like, I want to drink more water. I want to cut out on cold drinks and sugars and juices and stuff like that. And I want to eat more fruit. Because y'all know me. Y'all seen my last haul when I had all the snacks and all the stuff for Kaiser. I want to eat more fruit and just eat cleaner and eat out less. And I thought maybe I would eat out less if I meal prep. So a lot of this stuff I got to meal prep. I don't know if it's gonna be in the same video or this video, maybe. I'm not sure yet. But yes, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let's get straight into it. I didn't take anything out of the bags. I probably should have did that, but I'm gonna just take it out of the bags as I basically tell y'all what I got. Um, The first thing I got was some chicken thighs. I thought I could like bake them and um, you know, Bake them, put them with some rice and broccoli. <laughs> Y'all know how I feel about chicken thighs. Y'all know I love chicken. And I can eat chicken for days. I can eat my chicken thighs for days. So I got that. I might cook that tonight just as just like something to cook for dinner. And then the leftover ones, kind of like prep it and eat it for the next few days for rice. Um, I also got some salmon. I got four pieces of salmon. I'm not sure what I want to make today, but 
I don't know. I might make the sandwich today. I'm kind of in the mood for salmon. But salmon could be good for lunch. Salmon could be good for like a salmon salad and stuff like that. I also got chicken breast. Go get it sexy. Get it sexy. All right, I got these like um diced up little peppers, green peppers, yellow peppers, red peppers. I use this to cook my chicken. And I just like when they already cut up because I feel like it wasted so much time. I mean, they're pretty much like cut into big pieces, but I just, I don't know. I like cutting them. I mean, I like them buying them cut. It just makes my cooking process much faster. Um, I also got a big thing of strawberries. Me, Kaiser, Kobe, we all love strawberries in this house. Kind of like obsessed with strawberries, especially Kaiser. I really want to start putting like mixed fruit in his um, bag as well for snacks. So I got the big thing, but every morning, instead of eating anything else, I want to eat like a fruit salad. And just every time when I'm like craving something sweet or craving something that I ain't supposed to be craving, I'm going to try to turn to fruit instead of like, you know, going and giving me a zebra cake. I love zebra cakes, y'all. That's why I keep talking about them. But I got me some grapes to go with my fruit salad. I love these grapes. They're so, so sweet. I love green grapes. I also got me two different types of salads. Y'all know I don't eat salad dressing. So, um, yeah, I got cheese and bacon in one. And then I got corn and cheese and chicken in one. So, I also got me the meal prep bowls. I have a lot of these at the house, but every time I cook, I send somebody home with a bowl and they never bring my bowl back because why would they? And then the last time, y'all, Kaiser, the last time I made Kaiser like a fruit salad, and uh, um, uh, a sandwich last time I made him lunch. He left the bowl at school. I think he threw it away. So I got these for Kaiser. Just something kind of like seasonal. Really, really cute to put into his snack bag when I pack his lunch. I also got these little cute Tupperwares. I figured I would put my morning or like just put like my fruit salads in here. And then put like my real food lunch and dinner in here because the point the goal is to not eat breakfast or maybe eat like a boiled egg and some fruit for breakfast. That's the goal. That's the goal. And then salad or chicken and rice and broccoli in these. So yeah. I also got these little tick um not TikTok these teriyaki packets. To like make my chicken breast in. I seen this girl on TikTok when I was looking up healthy things to eat. She had like, I don't, she didn't have these. She had like little teriyaki, teriyaki sauce. But I got these little teri, teriyaki packets. I feel like I can't talk right now. I got these little teriyaki packets. And I'm just going to mix them in with my chicken and season it. And I feel like it'll be, put it over rice. And that could also be a meal prep too. If I want to do teriyaki chicken and rice. Or like a side. And then I also got these um, these little yellow rices. <laughs> oh, this is high in calories, y'all. But they just like quick little yellow rices to go with chicken as well. I got me some croutons, child. I'm trying to eat good, but baby, don't push it. I still gotta have me a little. Okay, I don't even think this is on the diet side, but. I was so amazed when I seen this. If y'all don't know, I love Indian food and I love butter chicken. And they had the little butter chicken sauce in there and I had to get it. I just needed it. <laughs> I just needed it for my soul. And then I got some jasmine rice. But y'all can see no snacks, no juices. Come on now, we're getting there. If y'all see how my grocery list looked before, y'all would be proud of me, no chips, no crazy stuff. I also got some turkey bacon for in the morning with my eggs. I got some spinach. Um, let's see. What else did I get in here? More rice, girl. I got so much rice. Let me see. I got bananas. I also got oatmeal for like the morning. Me and Kaiser. This is season my chicken, but let's just. I got some Tony. I always wanted to try this. This was like in injectable butter. I know, that's so fat. I know. I, baby steps. I'm gonna be eating baked chicken every day. Baby steps. Gotta season that thing up. Gotta season that thing up. But, um, yeah. I got this to inject my chicken with. <laughs> and see how it tastes. 
I also got some um, extra large shrimp because I wanted to make this little cucumber um, cucumber boat where it's like the rice, the um, shrimp, and like spicy mayo or yum yum sauce. I really don't eat this, but I'm gonna try it out. Cause I love yum yum sauce, so I just got some. I got a case of water, so y'all don't see on that right here. I got some chips, because I had got some dip. I know, it's my happy, but oh well. Oh no, it's only got 30 calories. I got some spinach dip, spinach and artichoke dip. Got these chips to go with it. And then another bag of rice. So this is my full blown. It wasn't too much stuff, but I more so just got some chicken bread, some chicken thighs, uh, a lot of more vegetables. I got spinach, but I have broccoli already in my freezer, salmon, cucumber, just a tiny bit of stuff that y'all see. I'm about to put it up now, but yes, you guys, I'm super duper excited to start this journey. If you guys have like any healthy recipes, so that's something good, like, it's not that I don't like eating healthy, I just, it's like, I feel like it, nowadays, it may be easier, maybe I've never looked into it, but it's more difficult to find healthy food. So, um, that's really good. Healthy food that's actually tasty to eat. So I'm gonna practice, I'm gonna look into some TikToks, I'm gonna try to see, like, you know, what I wanna make and how I wanna eat and, find what's good to me. I need to find my favorite healthy meal. You know what I mean? Something that's healthy that, is, that I actually love. So right now I'm just trying out a whole bunch of different stuff. And yeah, I think I'm gonna meal prep. I don't know if I'm gonna do it today. Maybe I'll do it today, but I'll let you guys know. Um, yeah, let's get straight into this video. Hopefully, I don't know if this is gonna be a full video after. But I'll see you guys a little bit later. Hi, so I'm all showered and everything. I know I said I was gonna, um, I'm, I may do meal preps, I don't know, but either way, I'm gonna start dinner just right now. I might as well bake some chicken, just so we'll have something to eat tonight. So I'm just gonna do my basic little chicken thing before I go get concert. Just like chicken thighs, I'm putting it in the oven, just keep it in the oven all day, to be honest. Um, so, I thought I'd season it before I go. First healthy meal. I thought I'd season it, washing it, seasoning it, everything like that. So let's get into it. So I have the chicken washed and dried over here. I'm not washed and dried, it's crazy. But washed and dried. I'm about to put these packets on the chicken. This will be my first time, but I heard it hit. And like I said, y'all don't judge me how I, tr uh, how I season this chicken because I said I was eating clean. I ain't say I was eating unseasoned, babe. Mm. <laughs> so, I'm just put that out there right now. Because I know everybody's going to say, she said that whole thing just to go and season that chicken. Crazy. I'm from Louisiana. I need seasoned chicken. Okay. 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 Here's my mom. Say hello, mother. Hey, y'all. Make sure you guys go subscribe to her channel. She's going viral right now. I seen you on TikTok, sis. Fit me? Yeah. What I was doing on TikTok? They posted your video on TikTok. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. Yes. I just touched the 
Oh, we got three. Yeah, I already told y'all that I was gonna eat cleaner, like no fast food, but I, I wanna season my chicken. And look what I got. Okay, I showed y'all that I got this. I'm gonna stick it in the chicken. What's the flavor? Girl, it's making it big. It's just butter injection, Creole style. Oh. Girl, I'm, I am injecting this chicken and it's getting swollen when I do it, y'all. This is so amazing to me. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I don't know if that's like, is that contamination if I stick it back in there and suck it back in? Yes, especially, that's for sure contamination, unless you're going to use that whole bottle. You should have poured some, you have to throw the rest of the bottle away after this. Hold on, I'm going to just put some in the cup, y'all. Yeah. I'm going to pour some in the cup. That's chicken. Oh. Chicken is like really like one of the worst when it comes to stuff like that. I'm gonna pour something in the cup so that way I don't have to keep going in the bottle because I don't wanna have to throw this bottle away. Okay. <coughs> this not don't listen to me, this might not be the healthiest meal for your health journey. It's still better than you know. It's just uh me cooking now at this point. Girl, this gonna be busted. I feel like I'm doing lipo. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so excited about this, y'all. <coughs> oh, shoot. I think I did enough. Inject it. Cut it. <laughs> okay. Now I'm gonna cut up my peppers. <laughs> Just annoying me, and I'm too about it. And the dirt that they do on my name turn to soil, and I grew about it. Time for y'all to figure out what y'all gonna do about it. Big wheels keep rolling, rolling. I'm outside, 29, G5, Seaside. I've been losing friends and finding peace. But okay, honestly, guys, it sounds like a fair trade to me if I ever heard one, and I'm Looks still so here. Good. Just focus on